Hey guys, it's Tony with Backwoods Biker Magazine and Wood Tramp Outdoors. Um, once I drop that video on the wool blankets, I've gotten probably, uh, I don't know, maybe 30 or 40 emails in the last three or four days asking me how the Fairbolt Mills performs. So that's what this video is all about. Hang tight, I'll be right back. I've had this uh, Fairbolt Mills, and this is called the Cabin Blanket. And this is a merino wool blanket. It's a queen size. Um, and it is one of the finest, if not the finest, wool blankets that I've ever owned myself. Um, these sell for $375 on their website. And as I've told you before, if you're going to go for a wool blanket, get what you can afford. Um, there are many out there uh, that are a lot less money, but they perform uh, subpar to a merino wool of this caliber. This is what I would call an heirloom blanket, uh, meaning you'll pass this on to your children, to your grandchildren, if you take good care of it. These are tank tough. And uh, what makes these so attractive is that they are flame retardant, they're water resistant, they retain their heat up to 80% of their heat, 80 to 90% uh, when they are, are wet. And your body, as it begins to warm up under a wet blanket, will evaporate all of the uh, moisture that's within these blankets. And of course, you know, hopefully you'll be around a fire. Uh, but, you know, instead of me just sitting here telling you uh, how to use your blanket or anything like that, I, you know, a lot of guys are out there showing you how to use a blanket pin and all that. But I, I'm, I'm telling you, uh, this will keep you warm uh, if you're sitting outside like I am right now. Uh, being sedentary. This will keep you warm down to a, probably about 35 degrees. If you are sleeping and you will refer to the video that, that we are, uh, I guess we it will be dropped by the time you see this on how to do the uh, blanket burrito. That will keep you down to about 35 or so as well uh, as long as you're on a browse bed or you're elevated off of the ground. Um, one of the questions that, you know, constant questions that we've received is on uh, have we seen uh, their their heavier blanket um, and I don't remember the name of that blanket but uh, I, I do know that it's much heavier than this and the answer is no uh, and the other question was what I would try to take this below freezing no it isn't that heavy but I mean it'll get you close hopefully before uh, the winter hits, we'll, we'll see that other uh, blanket. And again, if you reach out to Fairbolt Mills, uh, not only tell them that you saw it on Backwoods Biker, uh, but you want to make sure that you get the queen size. Don't get the twin size. It's going to be way too small for anybody that's want to do any type of, of wood tramping or bushcrafting or just camping out in the woods. So I hope that helped you out. This is a great blanket. I would highly recommend this blanket. Again, it's $375. And I know that's kind of on the high end of a piece of gear for your kit. But again, it's a lifetime. You can use it for a shelter. You can use it for a hammock. You can use it for uh, a leader. I mean, just everything other than just being a blanket. You can use it for a carry bag, you know, a tramp bag, whatever you, you need. It's big enough. It's heavy enough and it does the job. So, appreciate you watching. Hit that subscribe button, become a subscriber, and send us an email, and we will put you in our monthly database for free gear. So until next time, you guys ride free, you live free, and as always, you be safe out there.